Hey there guys, what's going on? And welcome to episode 3 of the pack and play series inside of the Ultimate RTG. And what's good? Hope everybody is doing well. We've got some content coming tonight. It's the start of the preseason promo. And what I've discovered on the starter screen are coordinates. And these are pointing towards the Alliance Arena. So is that something to do with the Sani transfer over to Bayern? Are we going to be able to unlock his one torch card for FIFA 21? That's what people are saying. Now, I think that's a little bit excessive. Like, are they really going to give out a free one torch card? It will be untradeable if they were ever to do that. But an untradeable Sane for doing pretty much nothing. Well, we don't know what the objectives are. And there's another coordinate point into Stamford Bridge. So is that going to be a Ziyech? That could be pretty sick. I'm I'm looking forward to the promo, especially if they do re-release like all of the team of the years and team of the seasons back into packs. I mean, that will make the Thursday rewards even more um, rewarding, I guess. But anyway, if you're enjoying the series and you want to see more and you don't want to miss any content for Fever 21, drop a like, hit the subscribe button, do the double. And if you want in game codes, G2A link below and use that code Fuji. So with that all being said, I'm excited for it. But I've also gone and made a very nice purchase. In my opinion, he looks like one of the best value icon moments that you could buy on the game. Now, as I said in yesterday's video, I was wanting to try Muller alongside Delaney just to see how that would fare. Like, tell Delaney to stay back, Muller can push on. So that frees up a left attacking midfield role without spoiling the concept player. Who do you think I've gone and bought? Any guesses? No guesses? Zola, John Franco Zola, icon moments, 291,000. That is looking like a steal. Now, I don't know how he's really going to play as a wide cam because of the stamina, but the dribbling, he's going to have that icon feel. The passing is great. The shooting is fantastic. The pace is decent. And look at all of his traits. Finesse shot, flare outside of the foot. I don't think you can really go wrong with that. What do you reckon? You think Zola is going to be a W or an L or maybe... A mini dub. Sorry for cutting the intro a little bit short. I forgot that I had to convert Zola. So he's now on the best possible chemistry until he gets that loyalty. But I want to speak about this man that is a complete mystery to me because every single time I come across him, I always make the same mistake. He was either an objective card that's expired or he's been put in the league SBC. And I was wanting to purchase him before I went and bought Zola. Because I look at his stats and I think he could play really well as like a left attacking mid. Especially like dropping back into the defense and breaking up the play. Like good stamina. And that's what he has over Zola. That's what I'm a little bit worried about. But anyway, we're going to give him a go. And someone said yesterday, Fuj, shoot across goal with Haaland. Trust me. Well, that's what I'm going to put to the test right now. I mean, 97 shot. He should be able to score those. I think I was trying that. But maybe I was a little bit too focused on the finesses. So with Muller, I don't think I'm actually in the right mind to want to be playing him as a CDM. But surely with an attribute or really a boost, that's the uh, anchor chem style that's given him a plus 10 to his stand tackle. Defensive awareness, plus 10. The interceptions, plus 5. Like, is he actually going to work? He better do. Well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try. So with my tactics, oh, let's uh, remove him. With the tactics, no real changes. I was playing some division rivals yesterday just to get myself uh, up a level. And I feel I feel good. Like, Haaland obviously isn't the go-to player. We, we know that. But if he is going to work for, I don't know, gold one. If we can finish gold one with Haaland and using Eddie up top, that would make me happy. Because we are coming up against sweats these days. So... I will make one change to the custom tactics though, and that's for, ooh, hang on a minute. Stay back while attacking for Muller as well. Mm, nah, 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 I don't want that. I don't even have my cams on come back on the defense anymore. Do you guys run that or not? Really, in this formation, I should have one of my center mids on come back. Yeah, I'm gonna try that. Sorry, center mids, my striker, Haaland. Well, let's try that, let's see. We're just gonna tweak some settings. And then what is the day today? It's Wednesday, right? So we've got the new promo coming out. That's gonna be awesome. Let's say, right, that they do, for whatever reason, release like a one to watch FIFA 21 version of Asane for FIFA 20. And he's been uh, position changed to a cam or that lead change and, and club change i might use him for this weekend as long as he's not like stupidly expensive 
Well, we'll see how Zola gets on. I'm basically writing Zola off before I've even used him. That's kind of mad. But I'm just... I, no, why am I doing that? Don't ask me. Let's try Zola. Let's see if he's a beast. If not, he's out the door. Game one. What have we got? Jovic. No, Jovic beat somebody in that summer heat showdown. Well, no, technically it's not a summer heat showdown. He beat him for the vote. And it was Ken? Was it Ken? It was Ken. How dare you, Jovic? Ken would have been sick. I probably would have still been using that card to this day. Down the line we go. People say that, like, they don't want to use Semedo because of his passing. But, like, look at that, for example. That's fine. I'm on side. Haaland. Oh, Haaland. One touch. Finesse. Oh. No, his, uh, do you know what? His finesse shots are a little bit sketchy. I need to stop. I, I feel like I, I need to stop doing them. What a ball though. Inside. Mendy. Was he in control of Mendy? Please, 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 please. Look how quick he reacted. You're going to have to tell me in the comment section. That's mine though. He showed me. Oh, he nearly showed me way too much of the ball. The one thing that we've got though is that Muller has really nice passing from, from deep. Eddie. Yes. Yes. Here it comes. The tank. One chance. One goal. That's not true. I've had one with uh, the finesse. What a tackle, Rio. Perfectly timed. Zola dropping deep as well. The first thing that I've noticed with Zola compared to... Oh, hang on, hang on. Sorry. Full concentration for this one. Little chip. What a goal. Maybe I don't score that with his three-star weak foot on the future stars. But the difference between Muller and Zola is that Zola is cutting inside more, more often, and I'm finding him easy for a short pass. It's nice to see, like, the differences, like, when you do make one or two changes instead of, like, a full squad. No, he's got me. It's... Oh, it's Jovic. Around the edge of the box. That was dead, though, from me. Someone said Davies wasn't good. Afonso Davies. I think he's, like, brilliant. I, I really like him. That's a good cutback. Eddie, use your strength. What did I say, Eddie? Use that strength. He's got pretty good technical dribbling. Finesse. No, oh, I screwed up. I, I, I took it. Ah, oh, I took the angle. Stilly. I don't know what I did there. Messed up. I didn't even need to do that extra turn. The strength, though. Ooh. Wow. I don't really mind who he's got as a left attacking mid or a left winger left forward. When I got that Semedo tracking back ability, I'm fine. But I, I, I believe we're playing quite well in this game. Haaland's had two really good chances. One of them came off the post with his finesse. The other that was uh, well, obviously a goal. And then the other one that I just took inside the box and his keeper saved. So I want more. Go on. Does he feel fast? Does he feel fast? He's got technical dribbling. Ay, yay, yay. He's got technical dribbling, but I don't think he feels... I don't think he feels as fast as I maybe would want. But then again, with all of these summer heat cards that have been released, I'm not even at all surprised. Like, Venetius Jr. doesn't even feel real with how quick he is. Go on. Yes, Rio. Go, go, go. I think a couple of you didn't even believe that I packed Rio, even though it was in the video. <laughs> I don't get it. They say, are you sure you packed Rio? Oh, Christ's sake. Yeah, I mean, I did have a video up, episode one, of me packing Rio. So if you don't believe it, you can go watch it. But now, Rio is just like such a good call. Really, really shocked, actually. Shocked I got him. Go on. Nice. Here, back, boom, boom, no. I've screwed up. I've screwed up again. What is up with the passing? Haaland, though. Little dip outside of the foot. I don't think he's even got that trait. Well, he obviously didn't need it there. So, Delaney, good stuff. It's nice to have him anchoring the midfield. For sure. Dembele. Oh, go on, Dembele. Nice turn again. What a strike. That's more like Haaland. Power shot. The Terminator is back again, boys. But that wasn't really a cross goal. That was just near post. Because although I'm winning 4-1, Muller literally hasn't made one tackle. It like, nah, it's a goal. You know what I mean? Uh, we might, yeah, we, we might want to change that. Oh, dear. Ah, Rio, 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 Rio. 
Oh, no, 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 no. What are we doing at the back right now? That is shocking. I got my feet all tangled up. That was shocking. Cut inside it. Cut inside. Maybe debut goal coming up for Zola. Ooh, that was dipping, actually. Not bad finesse, but... I mean, first game impressions with this Zola card. If I used him maybe two months ago, it might have been good. But right now, he's not really keeping up with the pace of the game. Haaland is, though. Like, massive goals from him. But I did mention we might have to use Muller as our striker for this weekend. One thing I wanted to quickly mention is that we might see a re-release of all those special cards tonight at 6pm. I've already claimed a mega pack for winning 15. I've got a prime gold players pack now. And by the time it comes around to 6pm, I'll have a 50k pack. So in tomorrow's episode, you'll see three uh, special packs. And if we hit a team of the year or team of the season, we might want to use them. Uh, in our starting 11, so that'd be pretty sick. But I think we have an issue. We've got a slight problem. Muller as a CDM, not a good idea. I don't know what I'm thinking about putting him there. So what I'm going to do right now for this game, I'm going to use Muller. I'm not going to use Haaland. I'm actually going to drop Haaland. I want to try Muller as a striker. Well, no, I can always sub. Should I sub Haaland off? Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll just do it like that. I'll keep the team the same. And I'll bring on Pogba for the CDM position. I know that I don't want to use Pogba. I'm waiting for the foot champ rewards to see if we get a CDM or something like that. But we'll have, yeah, Zola, left attacking mid, Muller striker, and I'll just bring on Pogba as a... Can I not start it like that? I don't know. No, I can't. So is Muller really going to step up? I know that I've had a few people destroy me with him in an attacking position. I always twist in, turning in my box. Watch that cut back. Muller, good interception. Zola, nice pass. Come on, Eddie. Already, just to start the game. Wait for that run, Chip. Ooh, I did actually put Chip there, which is weird. Like, I did LBY, but it didn't actually take off the ground. I'm not sure why. Go on, Muller. There you go. Maybe he does want to play up top. Get those uh, tackles in now, weirdly enough. But when he was a CDM, he didn't. <laughs> Hold on a minute. I've... Nah. Hang on, hang on. Oh, move out of the way. Oh, I pass over to Haaland and he didn't want the ball. Yes. Or he gets subbed out, though. Good layoff. Muller, go. Go on. Cross goal from there. Ah, oh, that's my rebound. Big yikes that I've actually been able to score that with Eddie. Uh, great game. I wonder if they're going to change that. Oh, do you know what they've added to, for 21? You know, if you do score a goal, the opponent's goalkeeper may react. And they start kicking the ball and going crazy. Delaney again. That was such a bad pass, but Delaney's got it. Muller offering support. Muller, he's he isn't bad on the ball. I'll give him that. And then in a great position, Muller. Wow. He was doing that yesterday. I don't you know what I mean? Like, I'm really shocked. For someone that has 99 finishing and just in general really good stats, he doesn't score as many as I was expecting. What a pass! What? <laughs> Who put that ball across the box like that? That was literally perfect. I should have scored. Delaney's let me down. Ferdinand. Oh, dear. He's going to pass that through. I've got him here. If he passes, I shouldn't have committed. Keeper. Oh, he's got me. Ah, oh, damn. Mine, Semedo. Good stuff. Dembele. Come on, Muller. Come on. He's got good straight line speed. And then I've got Dembele anyway making that run. Overlapping. No, look how much space that's opened up here. Little layoff to Zola. First goal for the club. Zola. No, I rushed it though. He started moving his keeper back. Like, I think inside his goal. That's pretty mad. Never seen that technique before. Towards the end there, I had a really good opportunity with Zola. I took it too early. I rushed my shot. That was my bad. But uh, midfield, uh, we're being opened up a little bit against this guy. He's using, I, I feel like he's a 4 1 2 1 2. What is his formation? 4 2 3 1. Maybe he's got his cam on comeback on the defense, like the middle one. And that's why I've noticed like three in the middle. I don't know. But 4 2 3 1 standard. Let's uh, push. Muller, 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 Muller. He's made a really good run. Best thing he's done all game. And then just lay that one back. Nice and simple. 
One, two. No, no, no. Oh, if I could have got that with Zola. Oh, that's who I was aiming at. That's unlucky. I would have just buried that with the finesse. Go on. He's rushed that pass. Muller. This has been a tough game. Zola. That's a foul. Oi. In a good position. Hang on a minute. Maybe Zola's going to take this one. Rykar with a yellow. That was a bad foul. But... How far is that? 24 yards. Zola's got 99 free kick accuracy. Come on, then. Hang on, hang on, hang on. That's good enough. That's good enough for me. What a goal. What a free kick. That wasn't even green. 99 free kick accuracy. What a way to score his first goal for the club. I mean, he's left it late in this game, but that is a sick free kick. 24 yards out, pinpoint accuracy. The power as well had to be good. <laughs> Look at that keeper. I had no chance. Keeper's gone through the net. We haven't won this game just yet. But if we do somehow get a W, I'm going to be pretty impressed considering his style and the way he's been playing. What a pass. Eddie's positioning. No, that's nasty. What a goal. Another one in this game. And he's quit. So we've only played a couple of games with Zola. I don't want to be too harsh on how he's performing. But put it this way. For his price, it does reflect what you're getting in game. Like moments of magic with his tight technical dribbling. He had a beautiful free kick there to pretty much secure the win. We didn't have to score that extra goal. His pace, he doesn't feel as quick as I was expecting in game. And his dribbling... Like I say, his technical dribbling is alright, but he doesn't have that, like, summer heat vibe with his card. And he does fall behind a little bit. So, as a left attacking mid, I wouldn't say that that's his go-to position. Middle cam, though, he'd probably be doing a good job. And that's why, like, let's say we do pack some, like, central cards from the Bundesliga or players that can get chemistry in our team tomorrow. Then we might consider going back to a 4 one 2 on 2 build just so we can maybe get rid of Muller or put Muller as a, as a centre mid. Because he worked well there. I don't mind him as a left centre mid, but if we're having to use him as a striker or a CDM, that is a no-go. So we've still got a lot of things to do. And then we've got the pre-season promo coming out tonight as well. So I'm really looking forward to that. Hope you are as well. And I will see you for tomorrow's pack opening. Enjoy. Well, leave a like and I'll see you tomorrow. Team out.